Sharks. My name is Alan Malin. And I'm Tristan Barrientos. Today is finally Friday. And, and you're, you're watching the BBN News. We're going to get to the news and weather in a moment, but we're going to start off with some sports. Last night was a huge night for athletics at our school. We're going to jump right into the boys' soccer team as they won their first ever playoff game in school history. Led by Jose Rodriguez, who scored a hat trick, and Elvis Martinez, who added another goal as the boys took down Sarasota last night, 4-1. Jose Rodriguez started the scoring with a free kick from way outside the box and drove it into the top corner. Rodriguez added a second goal shortly after with his incredible dribbling skills, and this time it found the bottom corner. Striker Elvis Martinez pulled off an incredible spin move and drove a line drive shot past the Sarasota keeper. His goal put the Bull Sharks up 3-1. Rodriguez added a late goal to achieve his hat trick. The soccer team moves on to the second round against an opponent yet to be determined. There, there was another first last night with the wrestling hosting a home match. They trounced ECS and FSCA. There were several individuals who went 2-0. Adolfo Antonio, Skyler Cruz, and Mateo Villalobos. Congratulations to all the sports teams on their fantastic night. Well, while we're talking about the night, I heard there's going to be some pretty bad rain going to be pretty bad today. So, let's see what Bryson Slot has to say about the weather this weekend. Thanks, Alan. As you can see, we had a foggy morning today. We will continue this trend because cl the clouds aren't going away today. We are in the high 50s as of now, but we'll be reaching the 70s by the time we leave school. Tonight at 9 p.m. tonight, there will be severe thunderstorms all throughout the night and throughout the day tomorrow. Make sure to stay inside because there will be strong winds and a 30% chance for tornadoes within a five mile radius. That's right, a tornado. That's pretty rare for Florida. Thanks, Bryson. Sounds like we're facing some nasty weather. Teachers and coaches, if you have any academic or athletic features you want us to mention in our show, email us at sharkstudios239 at gmail.com. That's right, sharkstudios239 at gmail.com. Continuing on with athletics, please turn in your permission slips and fees for our annual flag football game as soon as possible. Don't be like me and take an L. It costs $5 to play and $3 to attend the game. If you would like to sign up, there will be sheets in the cafeteria and on the bulletin board. And we regret to inform you, but the actual date of the game has been postponed due to minor difficulties. But be assured, you can count on us to keep you updated. Let's cover your athletic paperwork. The spring season is coming and you can't participate in any sports or tryouts until you've handed everything in. I speak from experience, so please make sure you get your physical in as soon as possible. Come on guys, we want some of you to be repping Bonita out there. Now that we have sports done and over with, we have a friendly reminder for all students. If any of you have borrowed a Chromebook from the Collaboration Center, please return them to Mr. Brady as soon as possible. We appreciate it. All OJT students, you need to stop by the weight room and see Coach Dombrowski this week before leaving the school. He will be in the weight room 7th and 8th block today. Attention all students, let's have a round of applause for all of the, our host of students. On Saturday 25th, we had many students head to the regional competition to compete. We now know that we have 17 students heading to the state competition in Orlando to represent Bonita. They'll be heading out on their trip sometime in April. Congratulations to everyone who competed and great job, Bull Sharks. In other host of news, you have to imagine how big the bill is for them to go to state, right? It's insane. So to get these funds, they need to fundraise, of course. They've already started their latest one. Hosa will be selling coupon books for $20 each. And in these coupon books, you will have access to savings that will be well over your investment. From these things like discount on pizza to discount on for tickets for sporting events. Discounts! For $20 each? So where's my money at? Where's my money at, huh? Before we sign off, let's update you on our Science Fair Regional comp competitors. Last night, Vanessa Kenley won many grand prize awards. Lauren Camper won third place in the biomedical category. And Bella Mason and Haley Pham won an honorable mention for Earth and Environmental. We have more results coming in for our bull in our next installment. Congratulations, Bull Sharks. And that's all for today, Bull Sharks. Thanks for tuning in to BBN News. And remember, just, just keep swimming. swimming.